between the home baked rolls and the Benton and Edges gold. <laughs> <laughs> a mad dash through the discounted and mixed matched. The Centaur of Plentor, up back between the fridges and freezers. It's the Middle Isle Podcast. Hello and welcome to this. Another look into some of the anomalies found over the last week in the middle aisles of our favourite German supermarkets. I'm your store manager, Rob. And I'm the guy who drops audible farts to embarrass his wife, perpetuating sexless marriage. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> this week we're joined by our long-legged and both been pegged Raiders of the... <laughs> <laughs> Josh. Good evening. And Tom. That explains the model. <laughs> oh, okay. Jesus. Dear, dear, dear. New, lo- new lows. New lows. New lows. New series, new lows. New, new highs for you guys, though. Hey. For the last week, we've all been loitering around the middle aisles of well-known German supermarkets, seeking out the most obscure and bizarre items that money can buy. We'll be taking it in turns to show our items, which none of us have prior knowledge of. So, without further ado, let's see who's at the front of the queue and spin the wonky trolley wheel of fate. Hey, hey, it's, it's me. Checkout one is now open. Check, check, check out. This week, I have a tablet lap tray. And it is like a shit cushion with like beanbag beans in it. With a piece of plastic to look like formica or something on top. With a little like <laughs> slot in it that you could put a tablet in. Love the the tablets form- not love, just go on your lap. Love the formica look. Well, tablets do go on your lap. <laughs> And this basically just puts it in an upright position, so you, like you could type, but you don't have a keyboard. You don't have a keyboard. In which case, if you did have a keyboard, you'd better have just bought a laptop instead. Yeah. And it's all kind of built in. It looks like could, the tablet's going to fall. You can just do it for your phone. Put your phone in the slot, Al. You stand it up or lie down. It's up to you. While you're on your tablet, yeah? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, While yeah. You, yeah. Oh, yeah, because that's as safe. A, as a side Why function. have you got McDonald's stickers in the back of your phone case? I eat lots of McDonald's. And fat. I think I think you could you could put your phone there and then you could chop some uh, onions. Yeah, definitely and just, could. Uh, yeah. And cry about yeah, your yeah. sad life. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, just just don't even eat the onions. Use the onions to bring out the tears. Yeah. Tear the cushion. Empty the beans out, fill it with tears. The thing is, this one, this one is is about <laughs> solidified tears. Soggy cushion. This one is about twelve inches wide, something like that. Speak uh, yourself. So, yeah. So that's already a pr- pretty big tablet that you could fit in there. Yeah. This this was the small one that they had. They had one that was like I don't know about for your flat 16, screen, yeah. for your flat screen <laughs> tablet. Sixteen inches wide or something. <coughs> what are you going to stick in that? Hello, yeah. Loads of porn. <laughs> Yeah, so I don't want to have a look. Yeah, let's have a look. It not, looks like a chopping board, doesn't it? Oh, no. Yeah. really looks like a chopping board. You can feel the cheap material on the back of that. That's not I mean, it's from the middle aisle, isn't I it? I know, look at that hemming as well. I've, I've, God, had, I've actually had, one, I've had one of them in the past. It was for eating your dinner on. It was a proper tray. Yeah. This is like, we'll put a slit in I've it. I've one of those. Now it's for your tablet or yeah. your, your laptop. It is yeah. that, isn't it? It's like, it's one of, yeah, it's exactly that. It's one of those trays with a cushion on the bottom. Yeah, you just eat your dinner on your knee, yeah. Now, yeah, they've literally Rob's just checking the quality by tapping on it. Yeah. Sounds shit. Yeah. <laughs> Let's have a squeeze of them beans. Bring it here. <laughs> <laughs> Awful. What What would you say is bean to bag ratio? Bean to bag ratio, <laughs> roughly, um, I don't know. <laughs> Never been asked that before. <laughs> I'm going to say there's one bag. <laughs> um, <laughs> 10,000 beans. Yeah. I'm going to say there's... I mean, for I'm, my case, I have, two more, I have far too much bag for my beans, I can tell you that. <laughs> I'm going to say four, four and a half thousand beans. Four, four and a half thousand. thousand beans. Right, so we're having a game of Guess the Beans. Yeah. <laughs> Cut this bad boy open. Get, oh, this get. could be a new section, couldn't it? Yeah. And this week's Guess the Beans. When on Taskmaster, where they made Josh, I think you just count ridiculous stuff, grains of rice and beans. Mm. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. Individual task. Josh Widdicombe. Josh Widdicombe. That's right. a guy, isn't it? Yeah. I wonder if he's on the Woody web. I th- do you know what? He definitely looks like he could be a relation of Anne Widdicombe. Yeah. But yeah. I don't think she was allowed to breed. Also, so. <laughs> also a virgin. Have you seen the, when Louis Have met Have you heard Anne about Whittaker? Jesus? <laughs> <laughs> he was immaculate conception, you know? Yeah. Yeah, that's what, um, that's what she said. <laughs> we all know Mary. We all know. <laughs> She was actually. We've got Jeremy Kyle now, Mary. You yeah. can't, fucking, can't hide from it anymore. Can't hide that. Anymore. Can't hide that waddle. Yeah. Can't hide that waddle. Should we? Um, should we move on? Checkout two is now open. I've brought 
a fun game. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. It's that classic fun game of let's see how hard we can kick John the dog in the face. <laughs> John, is it actually called John? What the fuck? If you'd like what is to it? just... Is it a dog if, you, if, you'd like, John? if you'd like to just <laughs> point to the bit where it says John on it. Oh, it does say John. Yeah. John. Yeah, it's, oh, it says John, Disney. It's, it's John the dog. Would they not call it like Rover or something? Like? Oh, is it Disney? It might be Winnie the Pooh. Oh, I thought it was a dog. <laughs> is it a dog? Is, is it, it Winnie the Pooh? It's, I think it oh, might. It's a no. dog. No, I think it's Winnie it the Pooh. Why is it called John? I don't know. <laughs> obviously not Winnie the Pooh when it's called John. It does John. look That's like Winnie the Pooh. Johnny the Pooh. John, Johnny the Pooh. John Leisure, Oldham. John Leisure. Is that who's building John those Leisure. lodges? John Leisure. 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 No, John Leisure Limited. <laughs> the John Nike Leisure Centre. <laughs> is, that, that is, is, that that is that what he went off and did after he got caught a, sniffing coke? That's the, crea- <laughs> that's the creative output of Oldham there in the football. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to call your business, John? John Leisure. John Leisure Limited. <laughs> nice one, John. Is the mascot Winnie the Pooh? For... John. John GmbH in Industrasi, Germany. 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 Oh. Yeah. It's got to look at that. Well, Oldham, Germany way. Oh, yeah. John Leisure Limited. You've got an Oldham in Germany. I wonder if he knows Gunthofer. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. What is going on? Anyway, it's that a, is it's, definitely it's, a dog called John. Let's have a look. Kick, it's not the, kick the, the dog in the face as hard as you can. Oh, whoa. Didn't expect that material. Mm. I should note that it is a football, by the way. Yeah, not a dog. It's a dog's Oof. face called John. wwwjohn toyscom Yeah. I'm He's on. not messing around, John, He's, is he? No. What's going on there now? John Toys. John T. Cool, huh? So, yeah, my item is a little yellow ball. It could be Winnie the Pooh. It that could, is Winnie could the be Pooh. a dog. Is Winnie the Pooh Disney? Yeah. Is it? I think so. No. Well, that's, yeah. this says Disney on the side. Yes, yeah, so it's Winnie the I know, Pooh. I but Winnie the Pooh isn't Disney, is it? Yeah. Oh, they would have bought him. They really? would have bought Win- him. D- Disney own everything. Pooh, you sell out. <laughs> <laughs> it's no wonder he all looks so sad. <laughs> Do they even have marmalade in America? Of course they do. Was it marmalade? Oh, Brush fuck off. That was Paddington, wasn't it? Yeah. So shit with Jeez. bears. No, he has what, honey, doesn't he? What's, what's, the, what's that stuff? Margarine. <laughs> you, your body God. can't break mar- margarine down. Do you want to know about JohnToys.com? Yeah, go on. Uh, das Spectrum kennt keine Gänse <laughs> und reicht vom <laughs> Hochwerting. You need to hit the Union Jack. Den. Leckierten Spielball. Chicken. Glitter ball, Saturn Hopper, Saturn Hopper! Oh, no way! The fucking Saturn Hopper! Cribbit will have a right lawsuit Flotten, on him. Flotten Sprung Ball, Fl- what? Sportlick Foosball, Volleyball, Basketball, Sowie Super Softball. Did he do a sport? Uh, that went a bit Welsh there. Sports Hello, soccer. and uh, <laughs> well, he's a volleyball, basketball, Sowie Super Softball. Welcome to John Leisure. Shaum Ball. I don't need John Leisure. Dash toys.com forward slash DE. Al, would you like to headbutt my item really hard in the face? Yes. Go for it. Oh, I've got to take my headphones off. Yeah. As hard as you can. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh. And it was at that moment, they realised that Al had never played football. They, they put, him back, put him back on the bench. <laughs> got to be honest, not very good at football. Yeah. I said headbutt it, not header it. I'm like not very good at headbutting either. Goal. You'd be good at Fair headbutting now with all your taekwondo and that that you do. Yeah, yeah. well, you don't tend to headbutt in that. <laughs> <laughs> that tattoo of the word fuck on your forehead. I thought I'd just had you down as a headbutter, that's all. Never mind. <laughs> don't worry about it then. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> Should we move on? I think we should. Who'd like to win something that isn't ridiculous from the middle aisle? Shout out to Good Life Competitions for sponsoring the show. This month they're giving away PlayStation 5s, Apple Watches, iPhones, tons of cash and a Tesla. Cha-ching! Membership's only £8.99 a month and it'll give you automatic entry to 30 plus competitions every month. All of which are live streamed every day at 7pm on Facebook, Twitch and YouTube. Members get 25 entries into each competition, which means you get an incredible 750 entries every single month. To sign up for your seven-day free trial, head over to our website and hit the support tab. There you'll find a link. It takes 30 seconds to sign up for their seven-day free trial and you'll automatically get 25 entries for the next seven competitions. That's 175 free entries plus 25 entries into their Tesla competition at the end of the month bringing it to 200 free entries for simply signing up. This Tesla's got your name on it. Head to our website, hit the link, and sign up to win it for free. On with the show.
Checkout 3 is now open. Now oh, what is that? That's dog shit. <laughs> I've got a plant roller. Oh, I? What the fuck? Those days are over. Uh, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Pack that in years ago. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, basically for if you've got a plant and you, you, you don't like it just being static... You can put your plant on no, there. I hate them I'm sick plants. of static plants. <laughs> exactly. Do you know what boring. I mean? Boring. They thought of everything, mate. You're boring. It's, it's Livarno. Livarno's a new player that, ooh, in the in Livarno. the Middle Isle game. I would like to point out. Livarno is you know similar to Ernesto and that, but Livarno deals uh, mainly with uh, things. Is for it your house. foreign language for living? <sighs> oh, very well, be. Lord, bloody hell! You've had your cornflakes this morning, haven't you? It looks very poorly made, that one. Smooth running, 360 Smooth degree, running. double caster <laughs> with rolling surface with soft rolling surfaces. Soft rolling surfaces. I don't know. So it's, you put your plant basically. You know, do you remember the do you remember the old uh, Lambrini plant feeder? If you yep. plant a bit of yeah. a piss pot and it can't be arsed walking. You've got a roller for it. Do you know what would be funny? If, 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 if you moved into like a really ropey gaff, yeah. Yeah. And you, you, were, you were a bit of a plant roller yourself, right? So you sat there. <laughs> one of your floors is a bit slanting, and one of your plants just starts moving across the room slowly, yeah. and you're like baked out of your <laughs> tree. Sozzled. You were just sozzled plant. out of your mind. plant just starts rolling towards oh, you. Oh! <laughs> you just like, feed me, Seymour. <laughs> the peace lily's looking at me. Yeah. It's, got two, it's got two breaks for stability. Twin brakes. Twin brakes. In Holy case, shit. in case it's gonna fucking what, get ca- away. In case it's going downhill. Uh, yeah, in case it's one of them escaping oh, plants. In case yeah. you live in a ropey gaff with uneven floors, mm, and you, you're a piss cannon. Yeah, so that's it. It's a bit like the wonky trolley wheel of fate, but not as wonky. Yeah. It's not the plant roller. I it's not the plant roller we dreamed of, is it? No. no. Tell you what, we could turn I've it into a wonky better, trolley wheel. Pl- I've we? definitely seen better plant rollers. Do you know what that. else it is? <laughs> Have you? It's a beer can roller. Are you, who are you? Some sort of plant rolling specialist. Well, it's quite good for passing things around the room, though, without having to get up, wouldn't it? You wheel what? something over to your mate. No. Or your mum or your sister or your dad. Let's have a go. All right. Or your mum, dad, me grandma. Uh, pass, pass me out Vindaloo over it comes <laughs> yeah. on the Vindaloo it'd roller a, it'd, it'd make a makeshift lazy Susan it would you could also stand on it in the night and fall over and break your neck and die spilt that beer you could <laughs> also use it for a, a, a tortoise that's got bad legs yeah, yeah. Or, any, or, or any animal with no kind, legs kind uh, do you know what that's a, that's a feel good thing that's a lovely it? thought i tell you what if you've got a tortoise <laughs> with bad legs uh, <laughs> do get in touch <laughs> <laughs> and we'll exclude this from the raffle at yeah. the end of the series and old, we'll send it out for if, Henry old, the old Henry with the fucking gammy legs it, has to, it, has, yeah. it can have a minimum of two bad legs <laughs> just someone out there breaking the another leg the last, <laughs> wasting, wasting to our meet time. the entry criteria <laughs> finally been waiting to get the funding he's just giving pages just got a quid yeah. just, he's found out two, just, two, two leg minimum just pulling a lump hammer out and going sorry mate <laughs> and if the ball, if, if the bad legs are on the same side it could sort of skateboard along and that would look great on TikTok wouldn't yeah. it <laughs> oh a million views instantly straight oh, yeah. away do you know what I mean yeah so you do it for the good of the tortoise yeah, no, it's like you can't you can't get away with giving the tortoise the hobble. Turtle hawk. Oh, tortoise hobble. Mm. Just think of the day he does his first nine hundred. <laughs> <laughs> On the half pipe. Just a little mini ramp in the back garden. Tortoise oh. hawk. Freestyle. Where's that fuck where's that fucking air? Get him back round here. Get him back round here, fucking dare him. <laughs> Have you played Newtonia Pro Skater? <laughs> it's fucking slow as fuck. Leeds. <laughs> Shall we move on? Big shout to everyone in Leeds. Checkout four is now open. Well, I've also got a plant roller. Get oh, oh, no way. Oh, He's not. But <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look the same. No, but you it are a specialist. This is more of a like a, a I'd say dish. a more of a deep a bespoke, a bespoke design. <laughs> You know, like, you if you want to take your paella for a walk. <laughs> <laughs> it does look like um, like a cast iron pan, doesn't it? Is it metal? It's a plant. No, it's plastic. Oh. It looks like the thing that you drain your oil from your car into. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oil drain pan. And yeah. it's, it's got a plant on the top, but the plant is soaking. Look. In what? It just, 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 <laughs> yeah. 
just sweat from getting about uh, on the that, roller. That's just a bowl, mate. That's, 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 that's why yours is like a contained unit, so you can have plants that have water. Yeah. Do you know what? It's got pretty. It's a Livarno as well. Wow. It's Livarno. No same, way. same, mate. Smooth running, three hundred and sixty degree double casters with hard rolling surfaces. Oh, mine was for soft rolling surfaces. Oh. oh. What's your max what? weight? What's right, your... Hang on a minute. Do you know what? If you got, if it's going to go on hard rolling surfaces, you'd much rather have the cage thingy. What's your biggest plant? Because then, you know, like you, you're watering it. You don't want water going on your carpet. Whereas if you've got a bit of a hard floor, you don't mind a bit of splash. And pack, also, a, a tortoise wouldn't fit in that one as well. I'm going to go and get mine back. Yeah, go on. What's your max weight? Oh, we're doing a bit of... Yeah. Is this, like, is this plant walker top trumps? Yeah. yeah. Mine's Lovano. Both Lovano, point each. Made, made in April 2021. Where's that? So mine, what? a modern product. Where's that? Hold on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> where, where are you seeing that? Uh, you won't get that to the lesser Mo- model. Mod- you, you, don't, product. you don't get that. This is, this is the upgraded <laughs> model. <laughs> Where's it, it say just on yours? says a little factory there. As you can see, it's got oh, a full yours 2021. Pla- yours is plastic moulded. Mine's metal, so it's got more scrap value. Yeah. That. What's your max weight? What's yours? 50 kilos. 50 kilo, 50 kilograms. Mine's, 50, mine's 51 kilos. Is yours, uh, is, yours, <laughs> is yours good for the environment? Is it FSC approved? No, no it definitely isn't good yeah. for the environment, mine. Um, what it, of course it is. It's got plants on it. Yeah. Plants are good yeah, for the yeah, environment, yeah. aren't they? So that's what so we need count, to do. It counteracts. Yeah, that's what we need to do is just develop a load of plastic trays to put plants <laughs> on and <laughs> solve global warming. <laughs> Can't go skateboarding on mine. What's the three? Can you go skateboarding? Oh, no, no, on you yours? can't three. go skateboarding on mine. What's the three for? Uh, three year warranty, obviously. Josh? Three year warranty. I have six half moons. We never, I've got we six never half think, moons. figured that one out, did we? The half moons? Yeah. No. no. The other thing we didn't find, find out as well, it's very occasionally some packaging just has a random number on it, but it's obviously a sticker that's applied. Uh, I don't yeah. know. Josh, why did the legs on yours look like they extend a little bit? Because I've said multiple times it's the premium model. Oh, right. <laughs> is it, it's got an extra four mil high on it with rubber yeah. wheels. Awesome. It, is, it is a toilet. It's, it's in case you want to roll it over something, isn't it? Look at that. Oh, Rob's got, Mine's a, like lo- a, Rob's got a low version. rider. Got a yeah. Low rider. <laughs> Baby, like them door. Plants that get you higher. Josh Josh is is get, a, you get some hydraulics on that. Josh is bent. Josh is bent to death. Yeah, yours is. Oh no, yeah, shit, who's sat on it? <laughs> Someone sat. Josh skateboard got around here. You know, you didn't give him a lift here today, Tom. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Park my ass in this, and you, I look like a dog wiping its ass coming round here. Do you know what I mean? I reckon you should get on it, and um, I'll tell you in my car. I reckon we should get some plants on them and have a race down the street. Definitely, we'll do that after this. Who's got loads of plants? I've got a couple in the back garden there that we can use. Oh, yeah, I, I think I've need... got two decent sized. We don't even need weighty. the plant. We just need the pot. Do you know what I mean? I've got pots and plants, mate. Thought yeah. you put those, thought you'd put those days behind you, <laughs> uh, I in, think we need a couple of shoelaces to tie them up. Oh, you can't tie a shoelace to yours, can you? Uh, no. <clears throat> uh, Why do you need a shoelace? not got a tow bar. Why did you <laughs> not so can pull it along? Bar. Listen, right. mate, look, ah. when, I'm, when I'm pulling mine along the street, stood up, and you're bent over double, <laughs> yeah. scraping your forehead as you run on the floor, right. then we'll see. The only way to settle this yeah. is to get the listeners to vote on it. Yeah. Right. Well, we'll see in the race. Who's going to win? Yeah, it's You're dark outside. You like, look like a pair of bellends, aren't you? Have you brought your uh, a high-vis jacket with you, Josh? Uh, yeah. I've, I've, got, I've got some in my boot. I, I always carry high-vis. I've got some yeah. in my boot. Scrub debt. <laughs> right. So, um, anyway... Rob, what's on the cards? What's on the cards? Welcome to... Uh, who's going to play Cards Against Humanity again? Because I think we had a uh, good fun with that. Just explain what's going on. We're going to do a little... Um, we're going to do a leaderboard this year for the quizzes. And to make sure that Al's involved, we're going to mix it up a little bit. So you'll get guest quizzes written by myself, Josh, or Tom. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, sometimes we might just play communal games where we're all involved. We touch tips. Or everything. communal. Yeah. Communist, communal. Ga- communist, communist games communist where game. jo- Josh takes charge. What do you mean? Tells us all about yeah, capitalism. He just puts us in the gulag and beats us. Yeah. Well, you're living in one already. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a prison if you don't know you're in it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so Al, uh, through Series 1, has been our resident quiz master, aren't you, Al? 
I have. Well, thank you for doing that. But he wants to get a piece of the pie. Or, but he doesn't want to get, is a piece of the forfeit. So we're going to be dishing out some pretty brutal forfeits coming on the leaderboard. Oh, what is the current leaderboard as it stands? Is it one apiece for you guys? For I think it's Tom one, one for Tom and one for Rob. I'm winning 10 nil. Right, sound. I think I think it's one one a piece for them. I think it was. I thought Tom had won two. No, I think Tom's won a digital oh, no, no, no. Someone, someone's won a digital, digital, digital well. Well. Tom's won a digi. Uh, so for uh, the uh, people who aren't listening, get to the digital. Well, doesn't know for already. For the people that aren't listening, no. <laughs> get to the digital <laughs> aisle on Patreon. Yeah. If you are listening, don't <laughs> sign up. But if you're not listening, sign up to Patreon, please. please. Fucking hell, I'm confused. Right, so um, we all know the rules of the game. If you don't know the rules of the game, uh, I've got some. Uh, questions or statements and there are blanks or they require answers and the lads have all got cards with answers on they have to play their best hand so uh, we'll move the wonky trolley wheel of fate out of the way and you ready Al you nervous I'm, First I'm racking it mate yeah. first one is what did I bring back from Amsterdam boom Bum, bum, bum. An erection that lasts longer than four hours. Wow. What did I bring back from Amsterdam? Seeing Granny naked. That's a weird thing to bring back, isn't it? Again. Did what it? did I bring back from Amsterdam? Gentleman's relish. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna say. Um, I'm gonna say Josh took that one. Ooh. Ooh. Game on. Right, next up is introducing the amazing superhero psychic duo. It's blank and blank. It's five litres of special brew and sniffing glue. <laughs> it's, uh, hang on, what is it? Get me the card. Oh, it is. is. There you go. So, introducing the amazing superhero psychic duo. Sidekick duo, it's a much younger woman and a salty surprise. Hey, very good. Introducing the amazing superhero sidekick duo, it's my genitals and trench foot. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrible. Please, could we say Tom's one so I can stop thinking about that? Definitely. Please, please. Oh, well done. Oh, God. Is that a point? What a That's superhero. I'll give yeah. that to Tom. Yeah, you know that one, though. <laughs> 1-1-0 one, one, Pipe down Al you're on, the, you're on the team now You're not on the I'm giving you a point Thank you Thank you Thanks Thank you Fun tip When your man asks you to go down on him Try surprising him with Blank instead Penis breath <laughs> uh, The more I thought about that The worse it has become Yeah Fun tip, when your man... Hang on, I can't read that, my eyes are fucking shit. Fun tip, when your man asks you to go down on him, try surprising him with fingering instead. Oh, God. <laughs> Bit fucking vanilla. <laughs> Fun tip, when your man asks you to go down on him, try surprising him with daddy issues instead. <laughs> oh, God. While you're down there. <laughs> <laughs> Sob. Um... I'm going to go penis breath. <laughs> yeah, but who are you choosing? <laughs> hey! um, bum. I never truly understood blank until I encountered blank. Got your wasted penis breath there, Josh. I never truly understood wanking into a pool of children's tears <laughs> until I encountered permanent orgasm face disorder. <laughs> 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 I never truly understood the true meaning of Christmas until I encountered glory holes. <laughs> <laughs> I never truly understood being understood being rich until I experienced a balanced breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Al, Al's got that. Oh, I got a point. That's my first point ever. Merry Christmas. Just to let you know, from here on out, it's not the taking part, Al. Yeah, right. <laughs> Last one. Last one. What's that sound? 
The pirate's life for me. I've not got good cards left on this. What's that sound? What's that sound? Erectile dysfunction. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, no, that's more like this one. A lifetime of sadness. Shout out to the residents of Blackpool. Uh, we, know <laughs> we know you're struggling. We're all here. <laughs> Need Some any of us, we're trying. <laughs> yeah, we're all trying. We made a podcast in our spare time. <laughs> <laughs> Erectile dysfunction. Wee, very good. Get so, who, who wins then? Who's there? Uh, that was Tom, wasn't it? No, I got I two. Keeping count. So, yeah, I got two. Oh, you got oh, two. Shit. You got two, one. one. Oh, we're so it's a tie, tie, tie break. Tie break. Tie break. Five. Yeah. Tie break I'll just give you my cards. Tie break. Well, we need some more cards for a tie break. That, uh, have you got another opener the cards yeah. are next to you yeah. aren't they well you don't get more cards no he's got the same cards he's got the same no, cards got the same cards here oh Al you're, you're not, not in the tie break you've got oh, yeah, one so point now you've got a bloody hell yeah good point it's alright well, right, right, I've got the same cards right. Right, okay here we go I picked it out white people like throwing a virgin into a volcano <laughs> <laughs> Jeffrey Epstein's New Island. <laughs> Tom's won. <laughs> yeah, well played. Two three. I cannot beat that with my hands. Are you folding? I'm folding. He's folding. <laughs> Fucking hell. Well done, Tom. Thank you. Can we get a round of applause jingle? Uh, I'll, I'll slap one in for you. Get in. I'll put one in now. Why would you have gone white Being people, on fire. Like inserting a mason jar into my anus. Maybe. Mm, you know. Judge his face. It, it, it didn't it's really have the ring to it. It wouldn't have been a winner. <laughs> it wouldn't have been a winner. It's not a winner. You know, he got no one to fold, mate. Yeah. True that. Nowhere to hold him. Nowhere to walk away. That was uncanny. Wasn't it? Thank you. What was it? <laughs> Kenny Rogers, the gambler. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's Kenny Rogers, the gambler. You're tuned into Radio Six. Thank you for being musically superior. Oh, you on a dab radio? Oh yeah, love fun on my dab radio in the kitchen on a Sunday afternoon, opening a bottle of red and cooking some out of Jamie Oliver's five ingredients. <laughs> What a decrepit nonce who got turkey twizzlers taken out of my high school. <laughs> I love that when you get those middle-aged men that say they're into cooking just because it means they can drink. <laughs> Joey, I like you know, I like getting into cooking with a bottle of wine. Well, no, you don't. You just like the wine. You just hate your missus and like the alcohol. Do you know what I mean? Let's not, you know. Mm. Jesus. Jamie Oliver will tell you that straight up. But, uh, what? <laughs> that he hates his missus and he only yeah. cooks so he can drink. Have you seen the size of a glass of wine he pours? <laughs> Yeah. So there it is, another Middle Hour podcast all wrapped up. Don't forget, for your chance to get involved, you can head over to Instagram and vote on your favourite item from each show. At the end of the series, the item with the most likes will be crowned the winner. All the items from the series will be raffled off and the money will go to the winner's nominated charity. We're also on Facebook and Twitter, so don't forget to give us a like or a follow and keep up to date with all things Middle Isle. If you find any gems yourself, feel free to share them with us as we'd love to see them. Also, before we conclude this episode, just a quick reminder that you can now subscribe to the Middle Isle podcast through Patreon. For just £5 a month, less than a pint in a swanky city bar, you get a week early access to all our shows, including the Digital Isle, which is now only available to Patreon supporters. The money raised through Patreon helps us to offset the running costs of the podcast and stops us from killing each other. There are other ways you can support the show. We've now got a merch page on the website where you can buy all sorts of Middle Isle podcast-related regalia, from hats, T-shirts, dresses and wallets to phone cases, blankets and notebooks. Or you can buy us a coffee through our Buy Me A Coffee page. All the details can be found on our website, themiddleislepodcast.com. Don't forget to continue to like, share, review, subscribe for feed, slip into conversation, play it loudly on the bus plate and the tannoy at work, word of our mouth. Word of mouth is the best way to get about. <laughs> Word, Word of, of mouth. mouth. Word, Word of mouth. mouth. <laughs> Word of mouth is the best way to get about. For now, it's thanks for listening. It's goodbye from me. It's goodbye from Al. Goodbye. Goodbye from Josh. Bye. Goodbye from Tom. Tata. Toodaloo. Send your complaints to Cards Against You Humanity and Nuttles. Yeah, big time. <laughs> now go away. Bye. Bye.